Oberlin College and the city of Oberlin are entwined. Founded together 181 years ago, the college world famous for its music conservatory, the city reflecting the energy, the values of this bastion of progressive thinking. People here don't just like Oberlin, they love it for so many reasons. There are always new people coming in. It always has a really fresh attitude. Um, and there's always lots of cultural things going on. There's really great concerts and plays and dances. Um, there's great lectures all the time. And a lot of them are free or pretty inexpensive to attend. Sylvia Koshnick grew up in her mom's store, Bead Paradise, one of many eclectic local businesses with deep roots in the community. Anyone passing through Oberlin in the last century has probably had a donut at Gibson's, a sweet tradition. Oberlin's a unique community. We're blessed with both the college and the community and the town. Uh, so it makes a bit of a diverse community in a very small setting. Uh, it's just a great location to raise a family and uh, to have a business. Oberlin City Manager Eric Norenberg says these businesses are a connecting point for students and residents. The weekend I came in for a job interview seven years ago, I was rec it was recommended that I come to uh, Gibson's, sit down on the, the uh, chairs out front, have a cup of coffee, and of course a whole wheat donut, uh, <laughs> and talk to the people that, that came by all during the morning. Ohio quarried sandstone buildings reach skyward around Tappan Square, and just off the square, another jewel. The Allen Memorial Art Museum at Oberlin College was founded in 1917. There are 14,000 pieces in the permanent collection, and it is one of the best college art museums in the country. At this college, being an OB often runs in families, as it has for Mayan Plout. And it's not just the diploma. The values kind of get passed down generation to generation, so caring about the world didn't start with me or my brother. It started with my dad and his parents, with them deciding that he could come here too. And that might be the city's calling card. Oberlin people care about the world. I think that might be the top thing. Oberlin people care about the world, making sure that the world's going to be a better place for the future.